Hello guys, welcome to Sovereign Solutions, your number one channel where you get solutions to all your sovereign problems. It's nine seven in class again today, how have you been? We are going to look at um, something very interesting as usual. We are going to show you how you can download um, QGIS on your PC. So we are downloading for Windows anyway on this particular video. And we are downloading the latest version that's um, 3.26.0, right? Good. So, um, for you to start, you come to your browser and you type um, QGIS download, right? Good. QGIS download. So, QGIS is actually an um, open source software, which means um, you don't really need some licenses and some other stuff. All you need to do is to just go to their site, which is where we are going to now, or that's what we want to access. Then you do what you download. So we are on the what the QGIS.org site, right? Good. So now let's click on the download QGIS. Okay, we can see the current version is um, 3.26.0 and it was released on the state. So yeah, there's a long term version of uh, 3.26. Right. Good. If you want to see some other releases, you can just click on this to take it back to some other versions of what QGIS perhaps you need them, right? Good. So now let's look at um, this um, 3.26.0. This is the link. Let's just open it on another tab and see how that goes. So there are different videos on the channel. We actually have a video on why you should use QGIS, right? Good. So you can see the download has started and it's about um, 1 gig or so. There are some other videos on the channel where I've shown you why you need QGIS and how you can use them um, QGIS for some other stuff. So we'll see, we'll leave the links to those videos on the description section where you can actually watch, where you can download them and you know you get the best out of them. Alright, so we've actually downloaded the QGIS um, 3.26.0 version. And then you know when you are done downloading, you will actually find it under the download and default download folder on your PC. So we've actually moved it from that uh, folder to our uh, user specified uh, folder. We are working on the folder called um, download QGIS. So this is actually what the installation, sorry, the installer package or yeah, the standalone version or something. So we are now going to do a just right click on it and we follow the prompt. good so we do what we click on install right click on it and you click on what you click on install good so we are actually on the setup wizard right good so let's see all right the setup wizard will install qgis 3.26.0 on your computer right sorry i have been skipping these words in quotes good so let's see this next Actually, you need to accept, right? Good. So, accept and then next. Yeah. Create a um, desktop um, shortcut. Then create a startup menu shortcut, right? Good. So, next. Ready to install. Click install to begin installation. Maybe you can go back if you want to make any other modification. Or maybe if you want to cancel, right? But we are going ahead store now one beautiful thing about um, QGIS is that there is actually a version 3.22 um, or so installed on the PC that we are working with as we told you earlier there are videos or there is a particular video on the channel that explains why you need QGIS so you can run concurrently different versions of QGIS on your PC so depending on maybe the specification or maybe how well you want to use them you can have different versions just like we are trying to do right now right Good. Good. So, as you can see, we've completed the installation of um, QGIS 3.26.0, right? So, click the finish um, button to exit um, the setup. So let's do that. Alright, 
So since it has been installed, we are going to um, check on our desktop to see the folder created. 